Oh, who's that? I wonder who that could be. Oh, hey, well, Father Raz. Hello, if it is How's my it favorite associate. Oh my gosh, what, what? Welcome, stranger, please. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Oh, great, well, I, uh, you look, you look awesome. Your house retirement been? Uh, well, you know what, what they say is that you uh, you get up in the morning and you have nothing to do. Oh, I bet you're trolling your th thumbs all the time. Huh? Well, by the time and when you go to bed, yeah. you're only half done. Only half done. Wow. Yes. Okay. Well, I'm I'm not even halfway done with all the work here. I'm sure you missed out a lot, you know. But uh, I hear you're at the Burn Residence, right? Uh, is that where you're staying right now? At, at the Burn Residence, which is uh, located on the campus of the. University of St. Thomas and very close to the seminary where I've already spent 26 years of my life. I know so it's, you're just coming kind of back in your own stopping grounds. Yes exactly and you may not know but I was on the committee that planned the new Burn Residence. Oh really? When I was at the seminary. Wow and that's been how many years now? That's been 35 years. 35 years so you can imagine 35 years you know they call it the Burn Residence but um, hopefully things aren't burning down over there. You know, no but you know we, we affectionately call it the Burn unit. The burn unit. Okay. Uh, uh, and not not because the guys are burnt out, but no. <laughs> but it's just a, an affectionate name for the place. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and it's uh, it's good to be uh, to be there with uh, colleagues that you've been in ministry with for a lot of years. Yeah. Uh, and it's a very comfortable place to live. You know, the the uh, location is uh, is right. It's right in the middle of the city. It's very convenient. Uh, and the guys do go out to help a lot in parishes yeah. uh, when when uh, priests need. Uh, help in the parishes. Yeah, like so, yourself, helping us out here. Uh, yes, yeah. you know. and also at Our Lady of Lourdes and uh, at the presentation, uh, another associate, uh, Father Peterson, yeah. often calls uh, uh, for help for me. That's wonderful. And, and the rest of the, the guys there as well. And so, uh, so after 35 years, uh, it needs needs some renovation. You know, so so such as leaking windows and and uh, and uh, the internet probably. Oh, uh, the internet. You know, the, uh, other things, the roof. You know, so I've heard about this um, gratitude campaign that the Archdiocese is helping out. Is we want to help support our retired priests, especially those who have given so much of their time and effort to serve our parishes. And this is the one of the, one of the small things that we can do to help to renovate and to help uh, update the, this uh, uh, residence for our retired priests. So uh, for our parishioners at home. Um, uh, you'll be receiving some communications there, and we just invite you to consider um, helping uh, uh, this uh, gratitude campaign, mm -hmm. especially mm -hmm. when we have someone who's just uh, so recent is living there right living now. There. And you may not realize that a lot of the priests who are living there are also donating to the campaign, all right. as I myself will do. Thanks uh, be to God. Well, thank you for all you do, Father. And, um, you know, you're welcome here anytime. Feel free to knock on the door, knock on the window, come in through any way, you know. Um, and you just kind of... Uh, uh, make yourself at home. Okay, I, I feel it's still it's still my home. It is kind of. Yeah. So. Well, thank you, thank you, Father Ras, and thank you all. God bless you.